In the Philippines, uh, illegal wildlife trafficking is a major problem. We are losing our biodiversity. We use DNA barcodes in wildlife enforcement to help uh, identify confiscated species in aid of prosecution. In order for DNA barcodes to be useful, so once you have sequenced a particular gene from a particular individual, you have to cross-reference it with a database so that there will be a match. So this is where the DNA database comes in. This information is important, especially from the perspective of wildlife forensics uh, and law enforcement, uh, wildlife enforcement, precisely because if they know where these specimens were collected, they can focus their efforts in trying to mitigate the illegal traffic of this species from that particular area. One of the biggest uh, obstacles in uh, working with these samples is that they come in different states of decomposition. So our problem is how to optimize extracting DNA, usable DNA, from these samples. The major benefit of using cryogen products is that we are guaranteed of superior quality of these products and therefore we get a high yield of uh, DNA for our DNA extraction regardless of what tissue type. For DNA extraction, we use the DNA blood and tissue extraction kit and then we also use the plant uh, DNA extraction kit. It's a Sisyphean effort but we believe that uh, even at the end of my career, I will not be able to confidently say that we will cover all the species here in the Philippines, but uh, we should never stop. We have to work together in order to bring about uh, describing our biodiversity uh, from the morphology to the molecular level. Kyogen. Sample to insight.